case of chain passing. On the overlap, Brazil has scores. Dummies and goes Tyrone Roberts. That is his specialty. Hello everyone, welcome to Rab's Rant for round 20 of the Rugby League season and it's been a fantastic or an unbelievable week in Rugby League with the Wayne Bennett scenario and all sorts of things but at this stage 13 teams can still make the playoffs and of course there's only three, the Knights, Canberra and the Sharkies who can't make it. So some very, very important games this weekend. Two great games to kick off the weekend, the Broncos and the Storm and the Knights and the Roosters. The Broncos and the Storm, the Storm have a very, very good record against the Broncos but I just get the feeling with all the drama that's happened off the park this week with the uh, Brisbane Broncos and Anthony Griffin being shown the door that I think that might steal this young side. I'm going to tip a bit of an upset here. I'm going to tip the Broncos to beat the Storm. Well, the Knights have been decimated. Not so much about losing last weekend's game in the Rise for Alex round, but injury-wise. Kirk Gillies out of the side. Chris Housen's out of the side. Darius Boyd, of course. You've all heard about the Darius Boyd scenario. Aku Uade's out of the side. James McManus is out of the side as well. So that's too many out for me. I am going to tip the Knights because I said because of Alex's scenario I was going to tip them all year but realistically you think the Roosters would win this one. Tomorrow the Panthers and the Sharks top V bottom and you can't see too much of a result out of here than other, other than a, a Penrith victory. I think if Penrith are going to be serious contenders this year they've got to dispose of the Sharks in a big fashion. I think they might do that. Titans and the Eels. This is a crucial game for both clubs. The Titans turned the corner a little bit last week. 22 points to wait over the Newcastle Knights. Parramatta have lost their last four. They need to get back on track. The Titans can't win at home, but I think they will this weekend. Cartwright has changed their routine a little bit and have taken them into camp, so to speak, for a home game. So let's see if that works. I think the Titans will win. Bulldogs and the Cowboys. The Bulldogs would have been stung by last week's loss to the Tigers, uh, while the Cowboys had a good win over the Sharkies. Cowboys, that's their first win away from home this year, and I think the Bulldogs might bounce back. Hasler absolutely gave it to the troops at halftime. Didn't work, but he gave it to them after the game as well. So I think they'll rebound from that, and I think the Bulldogs will win that one. Warriors and the Seagulls, probably the match of the round. Warriors currently in seventh position, mainly on top of the ladder. Uh, there's been the rumblings in the, uh, the Seagulls dressing room this week, and of course Kieran Foran came out yesterday and said some words about uh, all the off-field scenario, and they sh should release Steve Maddow. So I'm just wondering whether that might be a little bit unsettling. The Warriors, on the other hand, are at home. They have not lost at Mount Smart Stadium, but... I think the Seagulls, and I'm pretty certain I've gone the Seagulls here, and we'll get that up as we speak. There we are, the Seagulls to win for mine. They are on top of the ladder. Tigers and the Dragons, I'm really looking forward to this game. How good are the young Tigers? Moses, Brooks, all their young kids are playing so well at the moment. The Dragons haven't been too bad either, by the way, but I just think the Tigers, if they can replicate the form they had against the Bulldogs, they might win this one. I'm going to tip the Tigers to beat the Dragons. And finally, the Raiders and the Rabbitohs. The Rabbitohs would have looked at the start of the season and said, oh, no, Raiders on a Monday night, minus 10 in Canberra, this is going to be a real tough slog. If they want to finish in the top four, the Rabbitohs have got to win this one, and I think they will. There's my tips. The the uh, Broncos, the Knights, the Panthers, the Titans, the Bulldogs, the Seagulls, the Tigers and the Rabbitohs. Good luck with your tips this weekend and enjoy the footy.